How fast can you get from dirt to DL in Grotopia in 2023? A diamond lock is 100 word locks and a word lock is 2000 gems from the store. I have 200 gems right now. Here we go. Alright, I found some lava, let's break these. I'm already over halfway there, my goal is 200 seeds. I'm currently trying to find a buyer for my lava seeds. I finally found someone, let's sell the seeds. I'm going to lock a 5 letter word name with the word lock I just got, like so. I'm waiting for these trees to grow. It looks like some are done already, let's harvest this. I began building a dirt farm here that I can sell later. Breaking this is kind of a tedious process but it will be worth it. I began farming some grass, you will see why really soon. I also farmed wood, do you see where this is going? If you guessed platforms, that's correct, let's place this. Here is a quick time lapse of me breaking dirt. Also this is a good place to ask to please subscribe to me if you are enjoying this, let's beat this other channel. These are the last bits of dirt I need to break. Only two more and done. Now let's just break these rocks real quick. Let's go to buy DF to sell the dirt farm. I found this one guy who wants to buy it. I think 10 word locks is a decent price, let's sell it to him. There we go. I decided to buy some laser grids. I got a few, let's keep them coming. Alright, that's enough, I got one word lock left, let's farm them now. You know how it goes, I first placed them. Then I broke them, and then I collected the gems and seeds. Here's some time lapse of me farming, so you can see I actually did farm them all by myself, but I usually cut this part out because it's pretty boring to watch, you feel me? If you want to keep up with me, feel free to follow my Instagram and join my Discord server, both links will be in the description. I'm done breaking them, I got 6700 gems and 340 seeds. I found a buyer who buys the seeds 30 for 1. I found this another guy too who buys for the same rate. So now I have 12 word locks and still have 7000 gems as well. This is nice, let's buy some small seed packs with the gems. I found a player who wants to buy them for 4 word locks. Now I'm already at 16. Let's buy these mushroom seeds for a project. Can you guess what I'm going to make? Well, soon you can. Let's just buy a couple more of these and then I can move to buying the next seed. The next seed I need is brick seeds. A couple more of these as well. I'm first going to splice these seeds to make white block trees. And so I began splicing them, a long journey. I also had to expand the farm a bit to fit all the seeds. I was done and still had some extra seeds. Then I began harvesting the trees when they were done. And then I broke the blocks, the same old. I also got level 12. Yahoo! Is this what you want to watch? Is this why you are here? To see me break white blocks? Well... Finally, I was at the home stretch and then I was done. Wait, done. I got 257 seeds from the white block trees. Next, I need to buy some toilet seeds. This is not enough, we need a bit more. Luckily, I found another shop. This one only has 30. This one is a bit more expensive, but I couldn't find it cheaper. I just bought 265 toilet seats for 10 word locks. And so I began splicing the bathtub trees. After some time I had them all spliced. Can you already guess what comes next? That's right, harvesting them. Then I started breaking them and, as you can see, breaking bathtubs is really slow, so I went to my discord, and just like that, Swopix came to help me out. If you want to help me in my videos like Swopix, just join my discord, the link will be in the description and pinned comment as well. These are the last ones, and we are done, finally. So we got 219 bathtub seeds. Let's try to sell the seeds 7 for 1. 
I will use iHemo's Discord. It's a good marketplace. I already found someone who wants to buy all the seeds and it only took like a minute. They also gave me a hard sword. I now had 31. We spent 16 and got 31, that's 15 wordlocks clean. Next I decided to try trade profiting with farms. And let me tell you, it's not worth it. It took way too long, like that. I finally found a buyer and got a few wordlocks profit just by reselling a farm. Here I was coping saying that practice makes perfect when in reality trade profiting with farms is never worth the time spent. But I had 35 now, yay. So what did I do next? I went back to trade profiting even though I had just noticed how inefficient it is. What is wrong with me? So as expected I spent way too much time searching for a buyer. Like way too much. And when I finally found someone, I only got two Wordlocks profit for all that time spent. It was safe to say I was never doing that again. Well, at least I got some profit from doing all that. After all that nonsense, I decided to go back to basics and buy some laser grid. So I used seven Wordlocks so far. While I was buying more laser grid, this random guy wanted to give me a shocking hair, so I took it. I watched him menacingly while he dropped all his laser grids. As soon as he was done dropping them, I just bought the world. I forgot to give him the hair as a gift, so I buried it instead. So in total, I had bought a bit over 6000 laser grids for 37 wordlocks. I began breaking them, but quickly realized that would take too long. So I went to buy a spot from the world B break, but I only had one and I needed two VLs. But then something completely unexpected happened. This random guy who I had never seen before just randomly show up and look at what he says. He just saw my struggle and wanted to help me out. Can we get some hashtag good guy Antons in the comment section below? Then I began farming the laser crits with the help of some people. I had a lot of laser crits to go through. So as you can expect I did some farming and look at my game count go up. That is satisfying. Then the admin told me the hour was gone. So in the one hour rent time we managed to get 845 seeds. I had to buy two wordlocks directly from the shop to afford a new rent. So I paid and then I kept going. And just look at that game count go up, isn't that satisfying? These were the last few. Shout out to this guy for helping me a lot. So we got 1588 laser grid seeds and almost 33,000 gems. Next it was time to sell the seeds, I also got tidal shades as a bonus. I only paid 37 wordlocks for the laser grid blocks, so 52 for the seeds only is pretty good. Next I went to a BFG because I was missing some gems in order to buy a master surgeon's pack from the store. While I'm breaking these in 256x speed, please subscribe if you are enjoying this video so far. This took a long time to record and edit. Yes, I finally got the gems. Next I bought the tool pack. Then I locked a new world and dropped all the items in there. Next I found a buyer from Ihimos Discord and I sold the pack. I now had 81 wordlocks. Then I went to buy a ghost hunting set. The guy wanted to give me these items as a bonus. I used all my wordlocks to buy some ghost jars. It's the time to catch some ghosts. 
oh and i wanted to ask you guys what kind of videos would you like to see if you have some suggestions just leave them in the comments below i will read all of the comments as you can expect catching the ghosts took a long while this video is in 128x speed okay this is the last ghost and this is everything we got then I sold the ghost in a charge we got, then I sold the seeds, and finally I sold the set. We were so close to our goal of 1 DL, so I sold the hat and the shades, and boom, we had it. Thanks for watching, if you like that, make sure to subscribe so we can beat this other channel. Thank you.